What's up, YouTube? My name's Tim. Welcome to the T Flight channel. I've started this channel to document my flying and uh, my airplane building series. I am no video editor. I'm still very new at this, so please forgive the quality of these videos. Hopefully, they'll get better over time. But I wanted to have something I could look back on and see what I did right, what I did wrong, maybe get some feedback from some people. Uh, if you didn't see the previous video of me flying, uh, I started my flying journey back when I was 16. I uh, quickly ran out of money and resources to continue flying. I ended up stopping and then joining the Air Force and then spent 20 years in the Air Force. Life got in the way. I'm finally finishing those lessons now. Hopefully I'll be finished before the year is over. We'll see. But I've since ordered a Vans RV-8 and over the years I, I wanted to build my first kit back in 2004 but just never had the time to do it. I went through various models that I wanted to build. First it was an RV-7, then I wanted to build a 9. For a while I thought about the 14, and I finally settled on the 8. I do not have any laser cut parts, thankfully, in my kits, because I ordered after all of that happened. Unfortunately, what that does mean is I do have back-ordered items. In fact, I think I have 10 different part numbers back-ordered in the empennage kit, one from almost all of the major components, which is going to keep me from completing anything for a little while. In this video, we're working on the horizontal stabilizer rear spar, which we have the parts to complete it, but we don't have anything else to do any of the rest of the horizontal stabilizer, which we'll quickly learn by the end of this video. So this is just going to be a whole lot of back and forth, looking at plans, figuring out what we're doing, breaking the edges on those stiffener bars, and um, making sure we're doing things right according to the plans. My wife is all on board with helping so far. She's organized and helped inventory like an absolute boss. So I'm very grateful for her help. And she really likes clicoing so far. Uh, as of me recording the voiceover for this video, we've actually started working on the rudder skin. Uh, we've even got the stiffeners riveted on because we do have all the parts for the rudder. So we're going to attempt to complete that. Unfortunately, I don't have any video of any of that because I've had GoPro issues. So as soon as I get that straightened out, I'll start working on some more videos and hopefully crank out some more content here and document the rest of this build as it goes along. Okay, right here you see me looking down that channel. I'm actually trying to make sure that we've rounded over the edge enough on that stiffener bar so that it sits flush against that webbing as soon as it's all clicoed in place. That way there's no interference and when we rivet it later it'll lay nice and flat. Anyhow, if you see anything that I missed or you have any questions, comments, please leave them in the comments section down below. Uh, if you like what you saw, stick around. I'll try and crank out more as my travel schedule allows it. They will be sporadic, but appreciate you watching. I'd also like to give a shout out to Chris over at the That Hippie Pilot channel. I'll try and link his channel below if I can. His videos are excellent. Uh, he was my final push and motivation watching his videos to want to go ahead with the RV-8. So thank you, Chris, for all of the help so far and uh, looking forward to building the rest of this airplane. 